My name is Jack Roth, and I'm a thoracic surgeon at the MD Anderson Cancer Center. Well, thoracic surgery involves operating on organs within the chest cavity, and that is from the clavicles down to the diaphragm. I specialize in cancers in the chest, and that includes lung cancer, cancers that have spread to the lung, other cancers that involve the chest wall, uh, or other structures that are in the chest cavity. I was interested in thoracic surgery uh, after uh, rotation in medical school. Uh, I operated with a thoracic surgeon at uh, one of the Veterans Administration Hospitals in Baltimore, and I thought the anatomy was fascinating. My approach is to try to develop a patient care plan that will give the patient the best chance of being cured of their cancer, but at the same time, the lowest chance of developing side effects from the treatment. Oftentimes, uh, people who come in with cancer uh, ask what their chances are. You know, is this going to be a curable problem that they have? And with lung cancer, more and more now, the answer to that is yes, because they will get the best care possible, and also because of the active research that's going on. They will have treatments available to them that aren't available anywhere else in clinical protocols. I'm never outside of work. I'm always working. <laughs> and I think all the staff here at MD Anderson feel the same way. We're always involved and engaged with our patients around the clock. I do research as well as clinical care, and I'm very proud of the clinical care that I've given the patients. I'm also very proud of the research that we've done. Findings in research can oftentimes change the course of cancer care and provide a better outcome for thousands of patients. Uh, the research that I've done, particularly in the gene therapy area, where we developed the first gene therapy that was approved for human use, has gone on to become a field that now has expanded rapidly and is providing new and exciting curative treatments for patients. My name is Jack Roth and I am making cancer history.